This is your chance to praise Him. Hallelujah. Glory to God.
forget the uh, like this morning I'm thinking about it. all those. That's why I want to hear both of those songs. <laughs> hey, one of them I want to hear both of them. All right, they they all both right, go together. How many know they go together? Oh, yeah. Because I remember all of those who went. And those folks served so faithfully. Yeah. Everyone, I better not start calling names. Right, I'm going to miss somebody. Yeah, I remember every one of them at times. Yeah. Cross my mind that they're going on. I have to thank God. Thank God for their service. Is that right? Thank God. Today is Easter morning. On Easter morning, the faithful ones. How many remember the faithful ones? They will be right here. We're not missing. The faithful ones will be here through the weekdays. They would not miss. Yeah. Hallelujah. We thank God for each and every one of them. Yeah. Yeah, some of your people, I, I remember, I remember them all. God is truly good and mine is too. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. They left, but we still remember their works. How many remember their work? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. We knew that they would be here at this point. Amen. Don't take it for granted. In Jesus' name, we thank the Lord for all of the ministers one by one. We thank the Lord for our deacon brothers, trustees, mothers, missionaries, saints, and friends. Now, don't y'all get a hurry and a hurry me in the day, God. We ain't going to do but one series. Well, we don't do two. We got the Christmas. But on that one church service, the next one is a program for our children. Don't miss that. Amen. Amen. How many came for that today? Amen. It ought to be more here then. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank God for Jesus. We're looking at St. Matthew's 28 and 1. Somebody get St. Luke uh, 24 and 1. We're going to. I got the DV from what I got on my paper. Not too much. But let's see. Bible said the end of the Sabbath. As it began to dawn before the first day of the week. Yeah. Came Mary Magdalene. The Bible said came Mary Magdalene. I think right. Mother Critters I was were working on that right. Friday night. Right. Came Mary Magdalene. And I need yeah. to work on a little bit more on it. Mm -hmm. Suppose Mary didn't go. If she didn't come, then that part of your word maybe would have been left out unless the Lord sent somebody else. Mm -hmm. But it happened to be Mary Magdalene. Yeah. Hallelujah. She was the first to come back to the tomb that we know of, mm -hmm. other than the one rolling the stone up in. And, and the Lord coming back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the Bible let us know that it was, it was what? It, it was the end of the Sabbath. Mm -hmm. It began to dawn towards the first day of the week. How many know what the first day of the week? Amen. We used to think that the first day of the week was Monday. Uh -huh. I mean, they ever thought that. Amen. Y'all don't want nobody to have one. <laughs> but because we did everything on Monday. Right. And we thought it was the first day of the week. But when we got into the Bible, we found out the first day of the week is Sunday. Uh, done for Sunday. Mm -hmm. And God a good God. Yeah. That is the first day of the week. And the Bible tells us came Mary Magdalene. And the and, other Mary. And the other Mary. To see the sepulchre. To see the sepulchre. And behold. Bible says, and behold me yep. to look. Mm. Mm -hmm. There was. There was a great earthquake. A great earthquake. For the angel of the Lord descended the from heaven. The angel of the Lord descended from heaven. And he came and rolled back he the came stone. came and rolled back the stone. Yeah. From the door. Mm -hmm. And sat upon it. Yeah. Uh, 
everybody may not agree with what I'm about to say. See, the Lord himself rolled back the stone. Yes, the angel of the Lord. Yes, sir. A lot of time when they're talking about the angel of the Lord, Amen. they're talking about God himself. Yeah. I'm about to say, how did he do it? And he laying in the grave. Yeah. I was telling you that on Friday night. Right. <laughs> then you cannot kill God. How do you know that? No, no. Amen. See, the body was made to die. Amen. But the spirit of God, you can't kill. Amen. God was in heaven and on earth at the same time. To wit means to know that God was in Christ. Reconciling the world to himself. Who was in Christ? Nobody but God. I need to move on, y'all. Look. Uh, you take us, we, some of us have a whole kind of spirit in us. Is that right? I see folks all the time with all kind of spirit. One day they one way, and the next day they another way, and then the next one is another. Those are different spirits, wicked. But every time you seen Jesus, he was the same because only God was in him. Mm -hmm. Only God. That was the only spirit that ever lived in that body. God's spirit. Amen. Some of you all have multiple spirits. Yeah. Hallelujah. Some of you have demons. Yeah. I better leave that alone. Yeah. Easter morning. Hallelujah. And they need to be cast out. Amen. Am I right? Amen. If you get them cast out, you'll be a much better person. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lord have mercy. I better tell it. You, you won't be on cocaine. Mm -hmm. yeah. You won't have multiple friends. Yeah. How do y'all know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you won't want other people money. Amen. You have to sneak and get it. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. God, a good God. Amen. Yeah, all those are multiple spirits. Those are demonic spirits. Amen. And if you get them cast out, yeah. you'll be a much better person. But Jesus had only God's spirit. Yeah, right. That's why we're preaching and teaching not that you need to. The Holy Ghost. How many know you need the Holy Ghost? If you receive the Holy Ghost, every other spirit, then you're going to be driven out. I better get out of here, y'all. God is a good God. How many know he's a good God? Come on, let's, let, let's finish it up because I need to go to the other scripture. Come on, what? His countenance was like lightning. Uh huh. And his raiment white as snow. His raiment white as snow. And for fear of him, yeah. the keepers did shake. The keepers did shake. They had soldiers there watching. Hallelujah. Watching the grave. Make sure that nobody don't steal that body. That nobody come and take it or do anything that is unusual to it. Amen. Hallelujah. They make they want to make sure that they had him showing up capture. Amen. I know that they thought they had him. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. But right up under that nose. Amen. The angel came making all that noise. Yeah. The Bible says it sounds like an earthquake. <laughs> right up out of the door and rolled the stone away. God does what he pleases. God uses whomever he wants to. Not in your, it's in our mind sometimes, but God don't use this one. And God don't use that one. They got people believing that too. I was talking about them women earlier. Somebody want folks to think that God don't use women, no. I got my hammer out now, y'all. I've been preaching and telling y'all that God's word is like a hammer. I'm hammering now. But God use whomever he please. He use Mary Magdalene and other women. Quit letting folks fool you about his word. Again, let me say it. If the women hadn't brought back the report, because we had men, if I had been back there, I'd been right with Peter in the restaurant, yeah. yeah. hunkered down, yeah. scared. Yeah. You better thank God for some women. Yeah. Thank God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Athletes know what I'm talking about now. Y'all yeah. people talk about this. Yeah, yeah, see, sometimes you have to use your emergency. Yeah, 
Your emergency weapon that you have, God will use his emergency weapon, and that was women. Mm -hmm. But these women, thank God, had something going for them. Those same women was where? They went to the upper room after and received the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. God has a way to draw you. He was drawing those women unto him. God, look, I better say this right here. Women, God have given you something to do, and you better do it. Hallelujah. It is an emergency now. I mean, no, it's an emergency. Hallelujah. If very few men coming in the church, we're going to make a count right quick. Somebody look over there. <laughs> but women outnumber us, what? 10 to 1. Who God going to use? Where the men at now? Amen. Which one of them received the Holy Ghost? And how many women? I guarantee you, more women than them filled with the Holy Ghost than me. Amen. Mm -hmm. Now remember that God can't use you okay. until you feel with the Spirit. Then okay. everything applies to you. Then let me get out of here, y'all. Okay. Hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. The world is shook up now. And the world is in a backsliding state. Yes, if you ever needed Jesus, you need him now. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. The battle we'll fight now, we used to fight on the outside. Yeah. Some of y'all went back there. In 1970, the battle you see that we're fighting right now, we fought it out there. Yeah. But Macmillan with the sinners. Now we fight the same battle. That's why I'm so familiar with it. We fight the same battle in the church now. Glory to God. Let me get out of here. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah. If y'all don't know, I'm going to tell you on my knees on Wednesday, Friday night. <laughs> Hallelujah. But the same battle that is being fought now within the church. Hallelujah. Back in the 70s, 69. I heard the old preacher find the battle in the streets. Nobody in the church. It was in the street now. What that tell you? Come on, let's go, y'all. And for fear of him, the keepers did shake mm -hmm. and became as dead men. And became as dead men. And the angel answered and said unto the woman. And the angel answered and said unto the woman. Fear not ye. Fear not ye. For I know that ye seek. For I know that ye seek Jesus. Which was crucified. Which was crucified. He is not here. How many seek in him? Men yeah. ought to still seek him. Like they did back in those days. They don't quit seeking Jesus now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And? He is not here. The Bible tells us that he is not here. When you seeking him at, a lot of times somebody off. Yeah. Some, someone, you know, you, you, you is seeking him. They are seeking him, but he is not there. You won't find him in the clubhouse. Come on here. You know, a lot of times you're in the park, you ain't going to find him in the park. And the parties you be having, there. you're not going to find him in the party. You won't find him there. You're seeking in the wrong place. You got to come in the right place in order to find him. I'm in mean, experience that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I was looking for him everywhere I went when yeah. I was a sinner. Yeah. I'm in mean, look for him. Yeah. I look for his protection. Yeah. I, I look, hallelujah, for him to say something yeah. to me. We tried to bring up the conversation yeah. about him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it always went wild. Yeah. Oh, God went in it. Yes, you got to seek him yes, in Jerusalem. You got to seek him Hallelujah. in Zion. Yes. Now you got to seek him yes. in the church if you want to yes. see him. Ain't God a good God? Yes. Come on, come on. Let's finish up. For he is not here. 
For he is not here. For he is risen. For he is risen. As he said. As he said. Come see the place where the Lord lay. Come see the place where the Lord lay. And go quickly. And go quickly. And tell his disciples. And tell his disciples. That he is risen from the dead. That he oh. is risen from the dead. Yes, and behold. And behold. He goes before you into he Galilee. He goes before you into Galilee. There shall you see him. Lo, I have told you. Lo, I have told you. And they departed quickly from mm -hmm. the sepulchre with yes. fear mm -hmm. and great joy. Yeah. And did run to bring his disciples' word. Yeah. And as they went to tell his disciples, mm -hmm. behold, Jesus met them. Yeah. Saying, saying, All hell. All hell. Mm -hmm. And they came and held him and by the feet. They came and held him by his feet. And worshiped him. Mm -hmm. Then that tenth verse says, Then said Jesus unto them, Then said Jesus unto them, Be not afraid. Be not afraid. Go tell my brethren. Go tell my brethren. That go into Galilee. That they have seen the Lord. Which he has said unto them. And behold, they go into Galilee. Mm -hmm. And there shall they see him. Which he has said unto them. Go tell my brethren. That go into Galilee. That they have seen the Lord. And there shall they see him. Which he has said unto them. Go tell my brethren. That go into Galilee. That they have seen the Lord. And there shall they see him. But I tell you one thing, it's a good thing that they're able to listen. When you are able to listen and do what God said. Hallelujah. And they had to take the message. How many know that was a message? Mm -hmm. Thank God they didn't keep silent. <laughs> Hallelujah. How many know that God is speaking to all of us now? Thank God that somebody is not keeping silent. Somebody is telling me like it ought to be told. Hallelujah. They ain't gonna like me. But I ain't finished yet. Right. They ain't gonna show up like me. Yes. I'm coming with a weapon, hallelujah, that they never seen before. Hallelujah. St. Matthew 24. <laughs> and St. Luke 24 and 1. Thank you. I'm, I'm gonna get ahead of myself. Now by the first day of the week. Now upon the first day of the week. Very early in the morning. I, a lot of folks don't like to get up too early. Mm -hmm. Folks like to sleep late. For well, some things you got to get up early in the morning. Sometimes when you want to talk to God, I wish I had some time. When you want to talk to God, you got to get up early. Thank you, Chief. I woke up early this morning, right after 12. Got up. I wanted to lay there, yes. but I couldn't lay down. Yes. I had to get up. Yes. The Lord wanted to say something to me. Amen. Sometimes God says something to the preacher. Amen. He never said to you. Amen. He don't come and tell it all. Mm -hmm. Sometimes God want to talk to the minister. Yes. Sometimes it is not for just one word, but you got to get up good yes. yes. to hear. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. The Lord may just say, be strong. Yes. 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 And that be enough. Yes. Yes. Lord has the answer. Yes. 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 Yeah, the Lord be telling you sometimes to help me. Yes. Come on, mm -hmm. Yeah, help me. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And when God tells you that it's something yes. more that He wants you to do, yes. God a good God. Yes. And know that God requires some of us to help Him. Yes. That's what He told the women. Paul said, Help those women. Yes. That labor with me in the gospel. Amen. I think I'm bringing two messages in. Amen. 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 Help them. That labor with me. I mean, understand the gospel. Amen. That labor with me in the gospel. Now, y'all don't, I don't think y'all know. I'm going to have to work on that a little bit. I'll be back. Thank God, a good God. The word of God tell it. See, everybody don't understand the gospel. Uh -huh. That's the good news. Somebody got to tell it. Yeah. Amen. When you labor, when you labor at United Dead, you work in certain places. Amen. Yeah, you, you, you labor at Alabama Power, you work. Somebody had to climb the pole, somebody had to hook up the uh, transform and so on and so on. That, that's still in their what, line of work. Amen. In the gospel. Yeah, women got a right just like the men. 
I don't care if y'all don't like it. I'm going to tell you what Jesus wants to. Is that right? I'm going to tell you this before I go. I'm just starting. Starting up again. Now, on the first day of the week, very early in the morning, mm -hmm. they came into the supper. Bringing the spices which they had prepared. Mm -hmm. And certain others with them. Yeah. And they found the stone rolled away from the sepulchre. And, and they entered in. And found not the body of the Lord. And found not the women's dead. Women had been, men had made it that way. But regularly they were at home. Hung out down. Yeah, we, we, were, we were all together hung out down. And got scared. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. yeah, this time we were afraid. Because we, we seen what happened to our master. We seen what happened to our friend. We seen what happened to our God. We seen what happened to what we call our brother. That made us afraid. How many have been afraid? Yeah, I've been afraid. If you have an eye hair, and when fear hits you, when you know that you can be taken out, you run for your life. How many ever ran? I ran for my life. But we ought to love the Lord Jesus Christ. Because he never ran. He stayed right there. Look like y'all ready to go. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But he stayed right there. Hallelujah. Then let nothing move him because he had a task at hand yes, that needed to be taken care of to die for us. How many have been willing to die? Want to die? Huh? He want to die for us. He wanted to give up his life for each and every one of us. And you ought to thank God for it. Yeah, the women went there and put spices on his body. But he wasn't there. And, and it came to pass. And it came to pass. As they were much perplexed. They were very perplexed there about. Behold. Behold. Two men stood by them. Two men stood by them. In shining garments. In shining garments. And as they were afraid. Mm -hmm. And bowed down their faces to the earth. They bowed down their faces yes. to the earth. Yes. They said unto them. They said unto them. Why seek ye the living among the dead? Amen. How many know he's coming? How many y'all heard this girl? Twitting your tongue, your thumbs and stuff, and looking around, daydreaming. Come on, bring your minds in. Mm -hmm. Why seek ye the living among the dead? You're looking in the wrong place. There again, you're looking in the wrong place. Amen. Trying to find the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Among the dead. You won't find him among the dead. Amen. He's among those who are Amen. living. Amen. Thank God a good God. Amen. Hallelujah. You can receive it if you want to. Yes, Hallelujah. You're in a lively place. God has given his spirit to those who want it. Amen. Why seek him? Among the dead. I wonder if I, I, I have some witness here that you can see. You can find him here. Somebody found him right here. And because what you among the living. Hallelujah. Well, it is. Lord, I ain't going to say that. God is good, ain't he? Thank you, Jesus. And what? And he is not here. How many know he's not among the dead? You won't find him in the grave no more. He's not out there no more. Thank you, Jesus. He's risen from the dead. He is not here, but he's risen. Remember how he spake unto you when he was yet in Galilee, saying, the Son of Man must be delivered into the hands of sinful men. 
that the Son of Man must be delivered into the hands of sinful men. And be crucified. And be crucified. And the third day rise again. And third day rise again. And God is good God. God let you know that he's coming up from the grave. And he's not going to stay there. I don't want to will you, but I want you to know those who don't believe I'm trying to bring you a message to help you to believe yes, that he is alive. Yes, is. We're talking about Jesus, he is alive. Yes, is. How many know he is alive? Yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You got to know this for yourself. You can't read up on yes, it. You got to know it for yourself. Yes, I know that he is alive. Yes. I know that he's alive because he's living in me. Thank you, Jesus. When I was a terrible man, the Lord Jesus Christ made me a better man. Thank you, Jesus. Then I read about others know, others seen him. Hallelujah. What enhanced my understanding. What made me to know the Lord, that God is truly living. Now, excuse me, man. Hallelujah. I felt the Spirit move over with power. Yes, Lord. He is truly living now. Yes. Do you know that he's truly living? Yes. 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 Uh, then if you don't know it, then you need to go and ask Mary Magdalene. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. She'll let you know that he's living. St. Mark 16, 9 through 11. We're not going to read it. You read it a little bit later. It's too much for you. Thank you. And I know that he did. Because that she was a witness that Jesus is alive. Not only that Jesus, he appeared again to the women. Hallelujah. St. Matthew 28 and 9. You got the pen, you ought to be writing it down. Thank you. I'm going to let you preach to yourself a little now. Thank God, a good God. We know that because where well, these are witnesses that he is alive. Uh, yeah, we know it because Jesus appeared to Peter. Thank you, Jesus. How many know he appeared to Peter? Peter went to the tomb. Hallelujah. And seen that he was gone. Peter and John. Thank you, Jesus. John being a younger man, the Bible says he, he outran Peter. But evidently when he got to the tomb, he stopped. Yes, sir. And John, and, and I want you to know that John stayed on the outside and yes. Peter went in. Yes, he did. Thank God, a good God. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. They were witness mm. that he is alive. Yes. You can't take witness from folks who are around here now. Yes. Folks that never seen him. Yes. Folks that know him. Yes. Tell you that Jesus is dead. Yes. I want you to know he's very much alive. Yes. Lord said yes. yes, yes Lord. A folk who knew him yes, knew how he looked. Yes, yes. They knew how he talked. Yes. Hallelujah. They knew yes, how he looked. Yes. They know that this is Jesus. There's a lie. Yes. Come on, say yes. yes this Lord. is for all those who, who don't believe today. Yes. I am the one that do believe. We yes. want to enhance your belief. Yes. And know that Jesus is a lie. Yes, Come on, say yes. yes Not only that, uh, he appeared to the men yes. that he had supper with them yes. and emirates. Yes. Thank God a good God. Yes. And St. Luke 24 uh, and 29 through the 31st verse. Yes. Hallelujah. Those men, uh, had, they had a testimony. Yes. After Jesus left them, uh, you heard them saying, did not uh, I have a heart burn yeah, yeah. as the man by the way talk to us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want you to know if God come in and talk to you, yeah. that, that your heart will burn. Yeah, yeah. Now, your heart will get on fire. Yeah. Now, come on, say yes. Yeah, yeah. Now, not only that, he'll do an operation on you. Yeah, now, he'll move that stony heart yeah, yeah. and give you a heart of flesh. Yeah. Come on, say yes. Yeah. Now, in other words, Yes. Uh, he'd take the hatred out uh, yes. and put love on the yes, inside. Uh, yes. uh, come on, say yes. yes. Uh, oh, Jesus, uh, God is love. Yes. Uh, come on, say yes. yes. Uh, I'm going to love everybody. Yes. Uh, nobody, 
Uh, but I love even my enemies. Yes, Folk that don't love me, yeah. uh, I know how to love them. Yeah. Uh, come on, say yeah. yeah. Uh, they weren't done under my power, no. uh, but it's under the power of the Lord yeah. Jesus Christ. Uh, come on, say yeah. yeah. Uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, not only that, that Jesus appeared uh, to ten of the disciples. Yeah. Uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, in St. John 20 uh, and 19. This time, uh, when Jesus came in, uh, Tom was one there. Uh, up from heaven, uh, but Jesus, uh, he came through the wall. Uh, Lord, him mercy. Uh, the Bible tells us uh, this particular time, uh, Jesus breathed on him uh, and told him uh, to receive ye uh, the Holy Ghost. Uh, how did that receive uh, the Holy Ghost? Uh, come on, say yeah. yeah. The Spirit of God uh, in order to live for Him. Uh, yeah. Come on, say it. Yes. Yeah. You need the Spirit. Yeah. Hallelujah. Uh, in order uh, to have that belief uh, that you really need. Uh, come on, say it. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and not never seen Him uh, in the flesh. Uh, come on, say it. Yes. Uh, Lord, can I bring that yeah. this time? Uh, on the tender side, uh, seen him. Uh, now this was on Easter. Uh, come on, say it. Yeah. Uh, but the next Sunday, that uh, caught from heaven, uh, the Bible tells us uh, that Thomas was there. Uh, how many know that Thomas was there? Uh, the next Sunday, uh, seven days. Uh, hallelujah. The Bible says about eight days later. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, hallelujah. Jesus came in. Uh, he told Thomas to come uh, and feel the nail prints uh, in my hand. Yeah. He called a good God. I feel uh, what a sword went in my side. Uh, come from heaven. Uh, Thomas looked up at him. Uh, he said, my Lord uh, and my God. Uh, God. He will reveal to you uh, who he is. Uh, if you only believe. Uh, come on, say it. Yeah. This was the Sunday uh, after Easter uh, when Thomas was down. Uh, yes, Lord, uh, ain't God good? Uh, the next time, uh, Lord, him bricks uh, and they had got up a group of us uh, and they went fishing. Uh, I mean, it was all right to fish. Uh, some of us love the fish. Uh, we still the fish right now. Uh, come on, say yes. Uh, brother. Uh, it's all right to be uh, from heaven. Uh, somebody, uh, they take this scripture. Uh, they begin to say uh, that, the, that the ministers uh, had left their duties uh, and start fishing. Uh, come from heaven. Uh, but I want you to know uh, they had had that uh, much communication with God. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, they needed something. Uh, to relax themselves. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, but one thing uh, about God, uh, when time comes, uh, he will show up. Uh, come on, say it. Yeah. Uh, ain't God a good God? Uh, look at him, bricks uh, that he got ready uh, to come back and see him. Uh, the next time, uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, Go back to this time, uh, it was seven of them. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, they decided that they go fish. Uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, if I go fish uh, with somebody, uh, I want some competition. Uh, I want to take somebody uh, that I got to train. Uh, they was all trained me, uh, knowing how to fish. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, knew where the fish was. Uh, but when they went out, that they told all night. Thank God a good God. Thank God he showed up on the scene. I told him that to catch your neck on the other side. Come on, say yeah. They pulled in so many fish. Lord have mercy. And began to break the neck. Thank God a good God. God he's able. Somebody. Need of a blessing. Uh, you've been looking for a blessing. 
hands in a safe place Cause I gotta play for you now If God leads you and to do a thing Go with God and have told you to do it God will bless you now abundantly Come on, say it You open the windows of heaven And for your love and everything Pray me that you won't be to receive it and call to it and to get out of here now the Lord have mercy and the the fishing trip the Lord have mercy and the Bible told him he went and talked to the chief apostle now had to talk to Peter now there's some things that God had to get together now before he went back on high now come on say yes I want to make sure that his leader understand uh, what he won't turn uh, from heaven. So we had a conversation with Peter. Uh, Lord have mercy. That uh, kind of spruce uh, and went home. Uh, and next, uh, hallelujah, uh, he appeared uh, to about 500. Uh, come on, say it. Uh, Gotta remember telling him that uh, show them unbelievable that uh, we'll believe. Uh, Say yes, they look for him in Judah, not from 
heaven But they couldn't find him Hallelujah Because he was there waiting Lord have mercy Had another work to do In Samaria and Galilee Hallelujah and Bethesda They look for him in the masses They look for him in Philippi Lord have mercy They look for him Back on the mountain, but they couldn't find him there. They looked for him, hallelujah, at Gethsemane, but he wasn't there no more. Come on, say yes. They looked for him, hallelujah, at the deported. They went to Cana, hallelujah, but he wasn't in Cana no more. Where is Jesus? From heaven, he's not here. He really. That he's risen as he said. Say yes, say yes. Those of you who are still looking for him, I want you to know that he's waiting for you. He's waiting on you. Tell him that. And he's standing there with outstretched hands. I'm going to tell you this. Hallelujah. I'm telling you that the calm unto me, all you and a heavy lady. Don't you need some rest? Don't you need some rest? Are you tired of waking up sick? Are you tired of living a life that's gonna call you not to lose out on eternal life? Jesus is calling you today. Hallelujah. Why look for him among the dead? Come among the living.